Hello everybody, this is Maniac for Bricks, and I am here today with set number 6431, Road Rescue from Lego Town in the R-E-S-Q Rescue, like you see on the back of the torso theme. A little clever there. This set has 48 pieces, it was released in 1998, has one minifigure, and it retailed for about $4 in the United States when it was first released. So. It's actually a pretty basic vehicle. It's not really that special compared to other ones in the rescue theme. I have several of them that I have not built for reviewing, but I have collected them over time. And this is a very basic, you know, it's on the road. It's got a lot of equipment in the back, though, which is very nice. And you can fit, you have a jackhammer, you have a pickaxe. If I move this off, you can even see the buzzsaw and some binoculars in there. So it actually has a good number of... Uh, things inside you can even open up the doors on either side it has a chair and a steering wheel and if you're here from a previous review that I did on my channel for I believe it was the blaze commander yes blaze commander this is what I was talking about at the very end of the video because it's very similar in composition almost the same type of build in fact it, except for a few pieces here and there you can even see between them same vehicle base which is, you know, something that was common for the 1990s Lego town. But it's still not a bad set, in my opinion. I think it's nice. It's just a small, quick rescue vehicle. Something that has a lot of storage space in the back. You could probably fit another figure back there if you had another one from the theme. And as far as the figure itself, I actually do like how this one looks because he is a bit different from the others in the theme as far as torso printing. He has that little bow tie or regular necktie on his torso. He also has a radio printed on there. And I know that these have certain rankings, but I'm not sure entirely which is which. But it looks very nice. And it's one of the earlier types of figures that had double back printing, if I recall correctly. It's, I believe, is printed on the front, which is also a plus. And it has some pretty nice lights on here. These do have a tendency to fall off every now and then, though. But overall, it's a nice little set from that time period. Um, so thank you for watching this video, hope you guys enjoyed it, and if you haven't checked out the Blaze Commander review, you can see that on my channel, and you can check out some other LEGO Rescue related uh, sets on my channel as well, as well as other LEGO Town themed stuff. So we'll see you next time with more LEGO videos.